Jamie McCain, I already think of you as an animal. Hi, welcome to JOA. If you're new to my channel, please click subscribe and click that bell button so you'll be the first to know. When I upload, I'd really appreciate if you subscribe and click that bell. Also, I'd appreciate it if you stick to your promise and support at patreon.com forward slash JOA JOA. Patreon.com forward slash JOA JOA. Now let's get to the video. I also want to say free my people, free Palestine. You know, it's not really good, doing good uh, at the moment. Yesterday, the uh, Israelis army, they basically um, ruined every single media outlet, um, Al Jazeera. And, and we all know what's the reason why they did that. So people won't be able to showcase the truth as to what they have been doing for the past 73 years. Um, so this uh, video outrage about Mar Marjorie Taylor Greene, you know, came out in 2019. You know, she went to the AOC workplace and stuck her mouth um, under her, you know, it's a see-through door flap and she just kept talking uh, crap. And so I don't know if you guys saw this video, but I guess I can play for you and I'll come back with some more. You want to talk to Crazy Ocasio, you come to this little thing and you open it up and you whisper confession into her. Session. This is confession. <laughs> This is, this is Ocasio confession right there. Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez, I'm an American citizen. I pay your salary through the taxes that you collect from me through the IRS because I'm a tax-paying citizen of the United States. I'm a woman, I'm a female business owner, and I'm proud to be an American woman. And I do not support your socialist policies, and I do not support your murderous abortion policies. As a mother of three children, I'm appalled at New York's law for abortion, and it needs to end and it needs to stop now. You're bringing God's judgment on our country, and I'm against it, as well as my friends. So you need to stop being a baby and stop locking your door and come out and face the American citizens that you serve. If you want to be a big girl, you need to get rid of your diaper and come out and be able to talk to the American citizens instead of us having to use a flap, a little flap. It's kind of like her. She's kind Sad. Of She's like, she keeps flapping her gums. Oh, like, this flappy, is, flappy. Yeah. Okay, well, uh, each this, one this, of is this, is this is like child games. This is, this is well, child games. session. Hello there. Hello. Hashtag, where's AOC? <laughs> I hear you in there. This is creepy. It's, it's it hide is, and it's, seek. This is, this is, huh? Hide and seek. It's hide and seek. Tag, you're it. Guess what? You can't stay in there forever. Can you come out and play? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> All right, so we were, I guess she got the message before we came here. Guys, if you want to come out to yeah. uh, visit the socialist communist, Ocasio you're, you're a very good artist. I'm, I'm just trying to decorate. You know, this is her book where we sign it. This is her signing book, and I'm just signing it. Should we draw a wall? Should we draw a wall? Yeah, Let's yeah. Draw a wall. Where's it? Is there another pen? We really want to draw a wall, so let's draw what a wall looks like, everybody. This is a wall. So AOC did respond, um, and according to Jake Tapper from CNN, she said this is a woman that's deeply unwell and clearly needs help, and her kind of fixation has lasted for several years now and raised concerns. For other members, I think that is an assessment that needs to be made by the proper professional. And of course, had it been um, on the Democratic side, there would have been you know a huge, a huge freaking you know explosion about the Democratic Party. And of course, Megan McCarran uh, said her little two cents on Twitter and says, you're behaving like an animal. Harassing AOC like this only gives Democrats what they want, which is to paint all of us like we are psychotic, <laughs> psychotic barbarians. Aside from the fact that this just abusive and abhorrent behavior from anyone, let alone a sending member of Congress. Now, I do think this is crazy. I think this is borderline harassment and that is coming from me. The only thing I can possibly come close to harassment would probably be, um, you know, one time I was working at a Taco Bell and a guy came in and started uh, filming like, you know, and I don't like being filmed, you know, especially if I have my permission. So I went up to him multiple times and I told him to delete the video. Um, he was like way taller than me and, you know, so on and so forth. And so, um, 
you know, his mother was like, oh, this, he told the manager, this boy's like harassing my son. He is 16, yada, yada. Baby, I'm not harassing him. I simply told him that he shouldn't be coming in here with the damn phone and filming. Like you come into a place where you're about to eat. Do not mess with people that make your food, okay? Or even ring up your order. Don't mess with anybody in the restaurant because, okay, I don't I don't understand why people don't think people won't spit in their food nowadays because they will. I personally wouldn't, but a lot of people would. So that's probably the closest thing I could come in terms towards harassment. I would even call it harassment because, you know, he was in my, my space and my territory with the damn phone, you know, doing this, acting like a damn fool, no damn home training with these damn kids nowadays. Um, so... Uh, Marjorie Terry Green is crazy, okay? That girl is really crazy. I'm not sure if y'all watch Matilda, but she reminds me of Mrs. Um, Trunchbill. I think that's her name, the character that plays on Matilda. Hammer throw. Javelin. This woman is lifting weights. This woman is a business owner. Um, you know, she owns a gym, Marjorie Taylor Greene. So she a little cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. But she knew, she know who to mess with. She ain't gonna mess with like a black woman or somebody else. You know, AOC is a, you know, cute little, you know, I don't want to call her girl, but you know, a cute little uh, petite woman. And so uh, Marjorie Taylor Greene know who she need to mess with. And plus she's seeking clout and she's seeking fame. You know what I mean? So, and, um, the fact that the Republican Party is is accepting of, of this, accepting of canceling a woman whose policies I really don't agree with, Liz Cheney, is beyond me. But hey, what you gonna do? It's it's government. It's 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 the the country we live in, and it's not my problem. And I really don't give a damn at the end of the day because shit's going on in, in my country right now. Y'all ain't gonna lie, I went to Smoothie King and I was in drive through and this car like wouldn't go. So I said, move or come on, whatever. And <laughs> the speaker person heard me and I said, what can I get for you? And I told him my order and y'all, I think they spit in my shit. Like the, the taste is off. It's really fucking off. And now my throat kind of feels a little rary. Like, I, you know, I did shower, but that was like an hour or two before I went out. So... I don't know, and I actually like that Smoothie King. I don't think I'm going back now. Anyways, let me know in the comments below. Patreon, Patreon, Patreon.com, forward slash J-O-A-J-O-A. Deuces. Yeah, yeah.